Right. In the Raquel Community Centre, there's a there's a, an office where the janitors sit, and there's a pathway leading down, um, where there's the toilet areas, and then going into the back end, there's a massive big gym hall, and going out to the back end, there's the Raquel Roots, where there's a garden there that the children um, maintain from local schools and nurses. Yes, yes. I mean, and it, it ran every Saturday. Um, the Saturday club and the kids all used to come and help maintain it, plant, paint, have fun outside so when the weather was good. So used to do things in the community centre? Uh, well, I used to help with the, the children's club, uh, the breakfast club on a Saturday, and they'd done art, artwork, um, played football, played some games, and then garden things. Anything to do with the garden that was outside when the, when the weather was good. So it was, um, it's, it's a loss for all the children and the, the staff that used to go well, along yeah. This is my grandkids and they used to go to Rock Hill Community Centre for the shop down in March 2021 and really miss all the kids in the area day. We used it for the breakfast club, we were dancing, karate, we used it daily practically and it's really much needed in this area. It's far too, it's miles away to go to Milton and Hobbs. Otherwise, for example, even the golf course is a good bit away from here it is. There's nothing wrong in the community centre. I was saying it's not fit to build. It's probably cost a lot of money. But it's no, they say that, but the hybrid's going to be in as well. And that's fine. So we'd love to see the centre walk back up as soon as possible, please. If you find us on Facebook at Glasgow Against Closures or at Rock Hill, we'll see Rock Hill Community Centre. We need all the support we can get. Thanks very much. Do you want to see anything? See the Rant Hour community open to Pronto, please. Quickly. We want our community centre open now! Okay. So what we've got here in Rock Hill is a very wee community centre for a very big and diverse community. It's really, really needed uh, for the children, for um, all the different groups. It's the only spot public space for miles around and it's wrecked inside. It's terrible. Glasgow Life should be reassessing their priorities and uh, getting some uh, maintenance inside and getting it open again for the use of the people. Hi, my name's Paul. Um, I've came along here to uh, show my support for the community centre. Uh, I've stayed here practically all my life. Um, used the community centre back in the day. Now I've got children on my own. Um, I've got a daughter at seven. Um, they stay local. Um, the primary school was shut down here. The, the pub along the road was shut down here. There's no, no sense of community left here without the community centre. From the pensioners would use it for their Christmas stuff and bingos and weekly meetings. And the children would use it every day for after school clubs. For that to be took away is um, it's left the, the community barely any sort of gatherings anymore. So they can make excuses. Council, get the community centre back home, please. Thank you. Hi, my name's Mary. I just want to say I think we should keep the centre open. The kids need it. And we need it for everybody. Thank you. Hi there, I'm Henry and I'm from Rock Hall Community Centre. Um, just want the Community Centre open. We're up at the coast and it's not enough space. Um, we want this place open for the kids. And we want to open now. Thanks. Hi there, we're here today to protest on behalf of this community to keep Rock Hill Community Centre open. Thanks for coming Ashton, you hear that beeping there? That is about beeping for our Dexter sign. Dexter Cup is more than a data sign. So am I. All these places are the heart of communities and to shut it uh, means so much it has such a big impact on all the people round about here. So please, please, please join us and keep the Rock Hill Community Centre open. We want to open and we want to open it now. With the people and for the people. Good. Okay. Action. We are here today from the Save Mary Hill Library campaign. We were lucky, we, we fought hard and we managed to get the library opened, but it shouldn't be the expensive places that this local community centre in Rock Hill. People need this centre, local kids need it, local groups need it, so that's why we're here today. The council hasn't given another option where the kids and the local community will go to close their centre, and we think that's not good enough for us. Like Rockville, they need a facility like this, it's essential. 
Uh, so they uh, managed to get the library open, and it, it just shows that you, if you work at it, you can win. Small victories are very important.